What have you been doing uh, the last few weeks, I guess? A few weeks, yeah. same, same old stuff. Just keeping busy, working, working out, and, uh, you know, life's been good preparing for football. So are you prepared to sort of turn it on immediately whenever the word comes about the uh, lockout ending? Yeah, I mean, it's... it's it's going to be training camp and all those things. You know, guys will get a chance in to, to put in the work and, and get ready for the season. I, I believe that. And, and uh, you know, it'll be business to see. I mean, it's like every year, but until the actual season starts, uh, football is like no other sport. So those hits and that, that physical conditioning, you got to play to do that. So, I mean, it's not. It's not. It's the same. It's the same as every year. You know, you gotta get in. You gotta start playing. You gotta go through the regular football practices and all those things in order to really uh, fine tune and get ready. Using the platform I've had, try to do what I can to to work and help in the community and uh, with the BBF and what was started with with Joe Kelman. They've just done. They've done just that. A tremendous job. Uh, 50 years of service and uh, working in the community to better the lives of many, many youth. Uh, throughout uh, the west side and, and Chicago, so uh, just to come out here and be a part of this and the support is, is an honor for me. And, uh, it's going to be a great evening. You know, through, through some friends and, and uh, you know they, uh, you know what they do is tremendous. So you know we're just always looking to how we can work and what we can do to be better and, and looking to role models like the BBF. Uh, they have a great uh, group, a great team, and they've, they've accomplished some incredible things, so uh, just it's great to be a part of that.